Hello everyone, right let's do another GeoGuessr. So a lot of people who play GeoGuessr have been doing this country streak thing. Um, most people have been using like one of the worldwide maps, so a diverse world or an urban world or something like that, and then not focusing on specifically exactly where their um, the picture that comes up is, but just making sure that they get it in the right country. I've seen people get up to 20, even 50 in a row, but it's not been an official thing it's just been something people have been doing now this is now an official thing geoguessr have put it on here um built it into the game so you can actually do it i've had a go and my maximum so far is seven because i'm really not very good at this but let's have a go and see what happens i am going to use the yeah there you go seven is my best streak i'm going to use the default settings which is no time limit and moving allowed but i am going to try to move fairly quickly and not focus too much on each individual uh, picture that it serves me so let's go what i'll probably do is get it wrong lots and lots of times and um keep having to restart but i will uh do it for about half an hour and then stop and if i break my record then great now this is interesting so they're driving on the left and i don't recognize that language but they're driving on the left is it india then if they're driving on the left but then that's not india is it have a look at that sign maybe say indian there are a lot of different languages in india and sometimes there's something really obvious i mean that looks I don't know. Do they look Indian? That looks fairly Indian, but I don't know. I'm pretty sure they drive on the left in India. The other option, I guess, would be somewhere else in South Asia. Is it Thailand or uh, Cambodia or somewhere like that? But let's go for India. Let's not dwell on it too much. It was, of course, Malaysia. So let's try that again wolf 2009 okay this is Europe I think Unicredit Bowl Bank so that's Russian but is it actually Russia or is it Ukraine because I think they use the same font font not font alphabet script I know what I mean Well, I'm going to go Russia. It was Bulgaria who also used that um, style of writing, that alphabet. So, I told you I wasn't good at this. I don't know what you were expecting. How I got seven in a row, quite frankly, is baffling. Um... So I have absolutely no clue. I'm thinking Europe again. Initially. SL. Construcciones. Is that Spanish or Italian? It looks Spanish, doesn't it? The language. I mean, I, I, I only speak English. My grasp of other languages is very, very poor. So... Yeah, I have no clue. I'm going to go Spain. It could be Portugal. It was, in fact, Spain. My streak is at one. Hooray. Let's make it two. What have we got here? I mean, that's a bit... Someone's drawn that inside. That, that's strange. don't like that. A bit Illuminati, isn't it? Right, what have we got up here? don't know a lot of people who play this format do um, the non-moving one and it's good to see that GeoGuessr have added that option as well now you can turn moving off as well as setting the time limit I have no idea what that says 
Yeah, no, I'm not going to try to read that. Okay. Wait. Yeah, no. There's nothing on there that gives me any indication. If I knew the language, it probably would. But yeah, like I said, some people play the non-moving version and still manage to get streaks of 20, 30, 40 countries and I am absolutely not going to be able to do that. So I'm allowing myself to move around. Barisan Nazion, Nazion Nation. The stop sign says Berhenti on it. So what language is Berhenti? stop the flag there hey look that's the same sign as what was in the other one and that was um what did we decide that was did we say it was malaysia oh yeah i think it was wasn't it that's the same style of sign so i'm gonna go for it there we go you see the more you play the more you learn right i'm underneath a large motorway of some sort Driving on the right, this looks a bit, I was going to say it looks a bit America, but those don't. I suppose they could be. Massive billboard up there, let's see if we can get anything. At least see if it's in English. It's not, is it? No, okay. So where else has huge motorways like that? This is quite a big road though, so I'm going to go for a little run along it and see if we can find street sign as I usually do. Mm, so again, that looks like... Uh, Russian script, but that doesn't. Interesting. So I don't think it's Bulgaria again. There's a tram. Can I get close to the tram? Because it might say on it what it is. If I can see what city it's in, that's not very helpful at all. Okay. No, now the tram has vanished. Hmm. What's that there? That blue and red, is that Croatia? Possibly. Let's have a look. I'm going to go for Croatia. Oh, it was Serbia. Well, not too far off. But my streak has ended at two countries, so let's go again. There is a bus. What I really need to do is learn these languages. That looks Scandinavian to me, which means it probably isn't. So my initial thought is um, possibly Finland. I want to look at that signpost, but it's not a uh, Solna. Don't know where Solna is, so that's no help. Does Finland have these big tall buildings like this though? Sweden. I'm going to assume it's Sweden because that van says Sweden on it. Still Scandinavian. There we go. Another good thing to look for is domain names, because they can usually be quite a good giveaway too. So this, I don't know, maybe South Asia or Africa. Looks like Africa to me. Africa is a big place. That's French, isn't it? So would that mean it's Senegal? Let's go for it. That's over here, isn't it? Senegal. Yeah, there we go. S 
so we're up to two going for three not getting anywhere sometimes they come up and you see them and it's just so obvious you can just go yep that's definitely grease or whatever but not on this occasion are we thinking Africa again possibly I think that, well I reckon it is but what other indicators do we have driving on the right looks kind of English so the pro-life pharmacy I'm more pro-choice myself NHIS don't know Ghana that says Ghana there's an address on the sign for the uh, the pro-life pharmacy so Ghana it is made it to three how exciting and again no clue let's go for a little stroll is there a van with no oh good I can't go any further that way all right then well let's go this way instead try and find some indicator a lot of um, the more professional players learn things like the style of sign signpost um, color of number plates and all stuff like that and can go yep that's this country whatever straight away <clears throat> which I as I said need to brush up on a little bit macaron well that would suggest it's France wouldn't it? Macarons are French, aren't they? And that's French French road sign. Okay, I'm gonna go with that then. I'm not gonna dwell on it. <coughs> it was Switzerland, of course it was. Well, it was nearly France, look. Okay, well let's try again. <laughs> talk <laughs> the whole video is worth it just for that right let's see what we've got over there there's a sign there so I'm gonna go look at that if I can get to it mm, not really that's really unhelpful blurred Torage Palanga Well, I don't know where those places are. Again, my initial guess would be France, but last time I thought it was France, it wasn't. Something a bit more uh, clear would be good. About as clear as that road sign. What's that supposed to be? Right. Well, it's not like I'm chasing the streak, so it was Lithuania. <laughs> One day I'll learn what all the different things are. Today is not that day. Okay. Dot PL would suggest Poland. And it does, so that's good. Liquor area, okay. Got a double from the liquor area, right? Okay, that is Ecuadorian Amenti. Do we think it's Ecuador based on that? It could be, couldn't it?
Let's go for Ecuador. It was Ecuador. This is somewhere where they paint all their trees with stripes. Okay, I see what that is. Administrative block. Now, where uses that type of alphabet? Is that Bangladesh that uses that, or is it somewhere else in that area, that part of the world? Can never remember. It also doesn't look like I can go anywhere else, so I'm going to just go for it. It could be somewhere down here, though, couldn't it? India. It could be India because they've got that. Just looking at that there. I'm going to go Bangladesh. It's probably India, though, isn't it? It was India. Well, let's try a couple more. See what we get. Maybe I'll get somewhere good. Who knows? Not to say these places aren't good. I mean, somewhere that I can actually recognise instantly somewhere that's good for me this is a dead end no, it's not a dead end it goes around there that person's got lots of flags which would be great if I knew what country's flag that was wouldn't it is it Latvia I don't know I might be completely making that up it's a tree in the way now. Hmm. I've absolutely no idea. It's not that fear, is it? No, because that's that one. Hmm, that's a way of doing it though. Is it one of these? It's not Russia. Learn the flags. Not that far down, is it? I don't recognise that flag. But yeah, I am kind of cheating a little bit here because I'm just clicking through all the different countries till I see that flag. Just thinking with those stars though, is that somewhere more over here somewhere? Like, uh, it wouldn't be there, would it? Like, Taiwan, can I click on Taiwan? I can't click on Taiwan, that's interesting. I don't want to give this too much of my time. I don't recognise the flag, but I know I need to find it or I'll get it wrong. But I suppose there is a possibility that it's not the actual flag that's in use in whichever country this is. It could be like a flag of a different uh, different political belief system or something like that. I don't know what it is. Okay. I'm not going to get this one. Not easily. It's got to be somewhere around here though, hasn't it? Surely. Is it one of these? don't know I'm gonna have to possibly guess this one and sacrifice my uh, my streak well it's zero anyway isn't it so not sacrificing anything it's not Latvia it was Singapore so now 
I'm going to remember that flag is Singapore. I'm probably not, but I'm going to try. Okay, well this is fairly um, pleasant, isn't it? It's Europe. Stop for blink. Glostrup Street, that looks... Hmm, interesting. And that sounds like a fairly sort of British name, but I don't think it is because we're driving on the right here, aren't we? Nothing there. So, yeah, I mean, you can see how bad I am at this uh, country streak <clears throat> format. And basically, anywhere that isn't uh, the UK, specifically England, ideally with a railway involved. So, not going to get much from this by the looks of it. Otis, Mobile Cran, Mobile Crane. It looks like I don't know. It kind of looks a little bit like the Netherlands, but I don't. I don't know. I don't want to say it is. I'm just it's probably the river that's doing that, and the taller buildings around it. I've only been to Amsterdam. That's not true. I've also been to Wallaby World, which is in um, Hardervik or somewhere like that. Right, let's say Netherlands. It was Denmark. <clears throat> that trip to um, Wallaby was part of a trip to Amsterdam anyway and on the subject of theme parks curious so they've got a breakdance here right this is a theme park I should get this I'm gonna get I'm gonna make sure I get this and they've got a sea storm like the one that I always ignore at Chessington Tivoli, I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna say this is Tivoli, so that's Denmark, Tivoli Gardens in Denmark, you know what, can I find it, no I can't find it, I'm not gonna go to that effort, good, well, so give me theme parks and railways and then I'm fine. That's Spanish. That has the um, American style road signs. So, what does that make it? Is it a sort of Latin area of America, like somewhere in California, or is it Mexico, like northern Mexico, or somewhere like that? Very difficult to tell. It says San Antonio, which is in Texas, isn't it? But that's a place rather than a street name. But let's go USA. Good. Up to two. This is going to be the last game I play of this. Because we're up to 25 minutes and that's more than enough of me completely failing to play this game. I don't know how I got seven in a row. I really don't know how I managed that. I must have had a good run of uh, very easy ones. I'm guessing this is France. It says France there, but then that also says Geneva. Hmm. Is it Switzerland again? 
the fact that France is on the sign suggests you can go to France. So I'm going to go Switzerland. Yes. Going for four. This is not a theme park. But it does look like a sort of major landmark. And if I knew my um, fancy tourist attractions, I might be able to get it. But I have no idea what that is. So, don't know. There was one round that I played of this. And it literally came up right in front of the Taj Mahal. And I was like, yeah, I know where that one is. I can do that one. This looks like South Asia. It's going by the... Um, architectural style of whatever this is okay I'm gonna go India good okay I'm up to four so now I'll start taking it more seriously do we think this bus is in its home country that's dot LT which is Lith Lithuania, I think. It's not Latvia, is it? So. The bus probably is in its home country. But I'm just looking for something else to identify. I'm pretty sure L dot LT is Lithuania. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to get anything else here that really gives it away. So, let's go for that. Good, I'm up to five. Getting excited now, isn't it? So, has this got... Hmm, SL, no web address. Is there one opposite? I can see something reflected in the window. Yes, would suggest Spain. Let's go straight in for Spain. And we are up to six. Might break my streak, you know. I'm not going to break my streak. I don't think there's any danger of that happening. That's Greek. Is that Greek or Russian? That's Russian. They're very different languages, I know. That's Russian. So this is, but again, could be Russia or Ukraine or Bulgaria, apparently. So I would really like a web address, a domain name or something that I can... Uh, confirm it with I'm going to spend a little bit more time on it because I'm actually up to six which is um, quite the feat isn't it you've seen how bad I am at this it looks a bit touristy for Russia though That's not to say Russia isn't touristy, but I don't see it looking like this. Perhaps it does. Is that dot, dot com dot... Is that dot UA? Would that be Ukraine? It must be. UK is taken, isn't it? Let's go Ukraine. Okay, we're at seven. I've equaled my streak. So, I need to get this one right. I'm sure you all understand how high the stakes are here. It's Spanish, but that doesn't mean anything. It could be Spain, could be Central or South America. The baby is grizzling at the most inopportune time 
Let's see if that sign has got anything on it. Probably not. These are all places I haven't heard of. Funchal. Ribeiro Frio Fail. <clears throat> no, I don't think I'm going to get anything from there. So let's try actually... The thing is, I don't... It's like the middle of nowhere, isn't it? So... I'm in a forest. What has that got on it? This restaurant. What they could have done is kindly put their web address on their building. But I don't think they've done that, so... <clears throat> now I've gone over half an hour, I did not expect to reach my streak here, but I'm going to keep playing until I can, uh, until I lose this streak basically, which won't be long, it'll probably be on this guess because I have absolutely no clue where I am. There's all these place names that I don't know. It's too foresty for Spain, isn't it? I wonder if it's... Um, could it be Chile or somewhere like that? Is that foresty? I mean, Brazil's got quite a famous forest in it too, hasn't it? Camacha, Funchal. Let's have a look. I would hope one of those would jump out at me. You see, I am looking at Chile, but I don't know even where to look to be honest I mean get up here it doesn't look like it would be very foresty up this part of the country and could it be one of these as well this is a difficult one I'm gonna take do you know what I'm gonna guess Bolivia why not it was Portugal, so there we go. Well, seven is my streak. Seven is still my streak. I suppose I better go and sort that baby out. So um, I hope you have enjoyed watching this one, and I will see you next time. Bye.